Dear Hillary, this is a tribute from your father for the best life you lived in your time. Least in my life did the thought of presiding over the logistics of you or your siblings funeral ever crossed my mind. We birth children to bury us and not to bury them. I was so naive. I believed I will see you grow up and I will play with your grandchildren who shall bury me. From the moment you were born, you were named after great women leaders of the world, for in you we saw a bright future. Lately did we know you will die a tragic death. A death characterized by boot prints on your chest, a blunt object striking your head, step wounds on your breast and back, a gunshot at the back of your head and a bleeding nose. It never occurred to me and your loved ones in the family that we will have to identify you in a bush lying face down, with your hands clutching tightly on grass and shrubs fighting for your life. Distance of crawling to the road and the grass where we found you tell us the story of a fighter we never knew. Your daughter Alia said to us, Mom said she's coming to pick me up. Mom bought me this jacket. Mom is fighting. It was the latter waves and the strange dumping of a three-year-old that sent shock waves to our spinal cord that we are dealing with something that may end in tears. And indeed, it has ended in tears.